Tube Nation, what's happening, man? Super, super excited. Yes. <laughs> you know what time it is. Unboxing time. And if you've been paying attention to Bevel's Twitter and also Bevel's Instagram, you would know what this box is. You would know what time it is. In fact, if you've been say, paying attention to the great Nasir Jones, you know what this is. You know exactly what this is. But if you don't know what this is, you know what time it is. You want to do it. tab to open. By the way, let me mention something. This is how you know you, you have a serious attention to detail. The box shipped like this. They could have put it in a cardboard box or some other standard box. But they ship a box like this. So the only one other company that I probably purchased from. They ship like this. That was super bright LEDs in Missouri. Shout out to Bevel. The box shipped all the way from Shenzhen, China to my house in this box right here. So I found a little box going on. So let's pop this open. Welcome to the Bevel fam. I'm already part of the Bevel fam because of my. Uh, Oh. Damn, they could do that because I have the bevel shaving kit. Read this with your boy. Read this with your boy. We hope you enjoy using the bevel trim as much as we enjoy designing and creating this first of its kind grooming device. Your support is appreciated, and our entire team is dedicated to make sure you have the best possible customer experience. Please let us know if there's anything we can do to help. Thank you, welcome to the Bell family. Just welcome. Let's check and scratch. In fact, let's look. Let us look. Oh, here. Yeah. No, he's under the pin. Yeah, he, that's actual. I honestly think he, yeah. I think he and Nas signed a whole bunch of these. So I'm looking at it. And it doesn't look like it's a printout. It looks like actual ink. You can tell if you look kind of closely right around here. Yeah, they, that was, this is actually done with a pen right here as well. This camera may not pick it up that good. It looks like this was done with a gel pen and this was done with a standard ball pen. Ball point pen. So shout out to Tristan Walker, founder and CEO of Walker Company Brands. At Tristan Walker, this is Twitter. Nasty Nas, I see Jones investor. So for those who want to know why Nas is on this, if you heard uh, Nas album done from DJ Khaled, when he says signature fade with the bevel blade, bevel blade, that's a major key. He is referencing this company. And he's referencing this item right here. You know, let's get this out of the box. Attention to detail. I want to show you personal information like that. Which I come get me. Which I come get me. Don't trim me. Look at that, man. You know those times when you're just going through the city. See what we got on the side before we go inside. Includes bevel trimmer. Okay, I'm going to let it. Includes bevel trimmer, charging cable, microfiber bag, cleaning brush, blade oil. Okay, that's awesome. More information. Put my fingers back in and like that. Go to getbevel.trimmer.com. Again, consistent power and precise lines. So let's give you some specs on here. Powered by lithium ion. Graphics purely representational. Trimming power. Two hours. Wow. So bevel trimmers in blue. Electric cadmium powered battery. So in black. We'll put that to the test. It says it's purely representational, but according to uh, the specs, it is supposed to have four plus hours of constant cordless time. That's the cordless time. 6,000 plus strokes per minute. 60 days standby time. So you should be able to charge this up. And put volts back with 120 volts. You should be able to charge this up fully and leave it on standby for 60 days. So. Like I said, then they got some back. Let's get you get that right there. Let's bring this up real quick. There he is. So 
Nas gets his line up, he gets his line, his line up with the double trippers. Ready. Do some more features. Wait for yourself. And let's get into some more normal stuff. Quick adjustments. Those screwdrivers are hard when needed. Simply snap the blade off and adjust to zero gap. So we're going to show you what that looks like. Consistent power with it without a cord. It shouldn't. So basically what they're saying is when after you, if you're running with the cord on, you can. And if you need to go wireless, I mean cordless, so I say, you should not have a problem with that. You should just keep the power on. You shouldn't hear, hear or feel a increase of power. Easy cleaning. Perfect balance. Superior control. Fulton touch. Say, I know you're tired of this. Listen, right, let's get to it. Let's do this. Said, super excited. I've been waiting on these for like a while. I built mine. I'm over looking at like a chunk. Can you get it into it? Unless I'm doing wrong. So he's in here snug as a bug in a rug. I had two handies boys because it's, it's not necessarily kind of tacky right here. So once I did that, you know, I was looking weak in a rug. Once again, you got some more branding. Trimmers. Back. Presentation this box was very nice. Super, super nice. Here we go. Oh yeah. That's some that's real aluminum right there. The weight is off the chain. So blade. Juice to it. Actually, they send me instructions. This feels very, very comfortable right here. This rubberized grip. So you don't automatically get, you don't necessarily get power off top. And there's a two hours of battery. But what they do is they send you an email, letting you know, showing you like gifts, GIFs, on uh, what to do to maintain your blade. And one of them is that when you get it, you will have to take it apart. So y'all just happen to get caught up in the mixed feelings. And take this off right here. And the rest is this. Little tab, so let's do that. That's an attention to detail. So you let's show you the inside real quick. Okay, you got your standard spring, you got your gold contacts. See if you can kind of see a little bit. Which gold is one is a better conductor. You got the same gold contact leads on here. Oh, it's tight. It's tight. So basically, right here, you flick it up and it stays on. You flick it up and comes out. That's dope. These are supposed to be wall resistant coating, so if you got somebody that got one of these breezy heads, you should be good. So let's put this inside real quick. I bet he has put it here. I do not want to mess up the teeth on this trim. Cool tab right here. I can get it. <laughs> but yeah, let's just do that. <coughs> pull tab. Pretty nice pull tab. Being in the other side. So if you wonder why I'm going go so in depth, it's because I do have the shape assistant once again. And it's a uh, they have so much detail in, in like the box and the way things work. I expect that every time when I get a web product, and so far I'm, I've not been let down. Snap off the blade, got your charging indicator, power switch, charging cable. And I'm sure you got a charging indicator before you begin. Okay, they also have the instructions here, so they just make sure you're taking care of it. 
They overcome is approximately 60% charge, about two hours of battery life before turning on to the base light to the left. Move the battery pack. We already did that. Feels like fake and early. Here's the normal sound trimmers and power looks. <coughs> I'm not skipping over some of the blade adjustment, not the stress. So we're not gonna we're not gonna throw these away. Get your blade on and right, cool. My boy Floss would say follow those to the side. Pluck me follow to the side, so here we go. You got your charging cable, sorry, it comes out uh, pre-attached. Charging brick, pretty big charging brick, not as big as the iPad charging brick, but it's pretty, pretty large charging brick. You got your prongs, which you know, on her specific way, so you can't mess it up. Or you shouldn't be able to mess it up. Nice and snug. I'm going to leave like that because we're going to charge it. So that you can see the power label. We're gonna keep this box and then we have to care. Pull this out. Okay. A little plastic brush, but it, look, it looks elegant. I, I have uh, some wall clippers. You know, if any of you got a wall clipper, you get the, just a regular little brush. This one looks more elegant looking, even though it's still just plastic with the nylon. Bristles, they feel soft, feel nice. They don't feel like they just gonna come out on you. I give them that. There's a little recess in it, so when you grab it, you got a nice little grip. You just kind of go through. You got your double trim oil. Got the logo on here, looking nice. And then you got your trim bag. This feels really nice. And okay, the way this is designed. I don't think there's much room, you know, there's no room at all for your charging. You see the little kind of satin, glittery look, the shimmery look. Feels pretty nice. So a nice little way to carry you. If I, so let's put this all back in. <coughs> let's let y'all hear it one more time. Not better yet, let's do this. He's supposed to snap off. I'm afraid to do it. Unless we go like, ah, okay. There you go. They just snap out. When you snap them, you snap them out. Come this way. This is quality because this, this feels nice and heavy. Nice little weight to it. Okay, and I see the little body right here is zero. This is already zero gap. See the movement a little bit. Take two slide angle real quick so you can see the blades and rotate them. So this would it feel like under the street lights. Swag give it all up. Just to have another night like this. Downtown for work, rolling through the city streets. Shotty work the night shift, so I know that we desperate to meet them. When I see in my mind go, my heart be saying that she not the one. You might not necessarily be able to see that well as let's bring it in. Let's see what we get. Change the gap. Make sure we have zero gap up here. I ain't gonna drink my beer with these, and I will do a video on that. I talk about the easy use. We use the cut butter alongside it. Show you inside, right here. So you roll it more. Let's, let's get some juice. I think I like the wine. I'm like a supercharger. Should I do it right? There we go. Just 
clicks right back in. Yeah. I think put it vibration. And we'll also do a sound test to see how much louder or not as loud these are compared to the wall clips. Now, if you are a barber, the cool thing about these is bring this down right here. You have a little hideaway hook. So let's say you're doing your thing. That's good. That's good. That's good though. Cutting up, you got your land this, you got your wall, whatever, you about to trim up. Bam, you got these hanging. All the rest of the this is this doesn't feel flimsy. Yeah, this is solid with this. So when I move that, I move the whole whole base. I don't know if you want to see it. So bam, bam, hang. Boom, flip between them. You know how you do barbers do you flip between them, pop out. Put between them. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Really you don't really know what your heart is. You don't really know what her heart is either. Bam, it's just like that. Okay, the off top, the one thing I, I probably would have liked just to be different was instead of pushing, going up to. I know you can use it like this and you hit it like that. Probably where the button, the, the switch wasn't. Flick up, it flick now. That's probably the, the first noble thing. So, because if, you, if you're doing it, you're trimming. It, it feels more natural if you're going to use your pinky and you're doing your line to flick it down. as well flick it up, take a little more energy. That's the only thing so far. Like this feels comfortable, very ergonomic. Trimmers, man. I feel like it's gonna be solid, it's gonna last one. So, here you are, people. Level trimmers. Everything that comes with it, I'm just gonna bag it. Bag on top. This is what you get when you get your set of level trimmers. Once again, I will be doing a Video using them or beard, I let it go out a little bit, and it's kind of scruffy, kind of rough looking. So, you know, see, along with the cut buddy, the best lineup we can get. I think we can get really crisp lineup and really clean the beard the way I would like to, the way I couldn't do with the straight razor, or just say the Santa razor. But that's all I got right now. This is the unboxing of the bevel trimmers. Is everything we get? So far, I'm impressed with the level of detail, quality of the materials, the way it feels. But we're gonna put it to the test, see how it performs, and I'll let you know my personal opinion on it. If you are a person with a beard, you try to have a good set of trimmers to really give you that crisp one. That's all I gotta say. I hope you feel enough. Peace and blessings. I say. What it feel like under the street lights? Girl say that she hit the club out every night. She get laid to get paid. The lifestyle that she chose. Don't know why I try to save them. I'm no superhero. You see her hair done to two hours. Makeup took a